Hi guys, I'm going to do another unboxing today and I hope you enjoy it. This is actually the second video I shot, so it's already out of the package. Um, the first one was a very hot mess and we just don't want to talk about that. But it is a Diamond Art Club. Here's the key scanner on it. And it's the Dark Elf. I'm going to put up a better picture of that. Here is the better picture. Ain't she gorgeous? She's beautiful. Um, she is actually by Maria Gubar. G-U-B-A-R. Gubar. It's probably Gubar because I always spell everything pronounce everything wrong see I can't even talk today that's why the first video was such a hot mess but uh, she was uh, $37.95 put this away she is a 42 by 50 round drill you've got your nine instructions on the back of the box it also comes with the contents of the package. Now there was something different about this toolkit that I got today. Y'all tell me what's what's different here. I got the single tip pen. Got baggies. They're a little flimsy but they're baggies they hold leftover diamonds really good if you save your diamonds I personally do not don't choke on your morning coffee there I feel that I spent pay money for my full painting and if I run out then I contact the company and they send me more now I've never I've only run out of one color from a company on AliExpress, and that was um, Ever Moment, which is very unusual for them. But if you do miss diamonds or something in the toolkit that you need, whatever it is, from the toolkit to the painting to the diamonds, anything, contact customer service. Now, I'm not going to cut call customer service over this because it's too silly. To contact them over this but like I said any problems please contact Diamond Art Club or uh, any customer support for your help okay three tip I don't know if I said that a clear boat with a funnel and I got a bit squishy and that's all that came in here now, the one thing that kind of upset me is y'all know what I'm missing. Or should I say experienced or somebody that has at least done one diamond painting can tell you what is missing out of this toolkit is something vital, vital to diamond painting because you cannot do it without some type of glue. Now, Diamond Art Club normally sends two heart-shaped um, cutouts of wax. You can't diamond paint without wax, so um, I'm not going to contact Diamond Art Club over two plates of wax when I have plenty of it. But if you are a new customer and you don't know what's in the toolkit, Here's what this came with minus the glue. So if you need glue, contact their customer service and they'd be happy to send it out to you. Okay, so that's enough of the toolkit. Um, these baggies are really nice too. You can save them and put in there whatever you want. You can even rinse them out, put candy in them. They're so sturdy. Okay, on to the painting. Here's the Dark Elf, again. Now I showed you the picture of her on my iPad and you could just see the vibrant colors that are throughout this painting. 
I mean, there's blue, there's turquoise, there's aqua, there's green, there's even yellow, orange in here. Um, that is a flower in her hair, and it, it's just beautiful. It's a different type of painting than what I normally get, but I think she'll be fun to do. And she's at a size to where if you've done a big one, she would be a nice one to come in and do after you do a big one. I know that's the way I am. Um, I've done three big size to me personally. Um, like you've seen me put my hand up here on my chest. <laughs> um, I like to take it easy after a couple of bigger ones and do a smaller one. And this to me is the perfect size to come in and do after, you know, doing some big paintings. Um, this does have the clear plastic on it and the plate painting is plenty sticky. I'm going to get my finger off now. Plenty sticky. And with that cover and the soft canvas on the back, it makes it to where it flattens out real easy and it keeps the damage, it keeps the uh, canvas from having rivers, uh, stuff like that, creases in your glue. See how straight that is already? It's laying flat and all I did was this a couple times. So um, that's what the clear, clear plastic helps you do. Um, I know a lot of people don't like the clear plastic and they'll cover it up and put parchment paper on it. Um, I like the clear because, like I said, it does um, keep the canvas from raveling and all that kind of good stuff. So it does have the uh, serrated edges, too. that keeps the canvas itself from raveling and falling apart. It's got stitch all the way across all the way down and then the uh, cut out so that's the dark yellow well if i didn't tell you i think there's 33 no 35 colors there's one ab let me get into some of these three colors now something else diamond art club is doing I forgot to put it back in, in the box, but they have this legend now as an inventory sheet that shows every color. It shows the thumbnail, shows every color and symbol, and this is their version of an inventory sheet, and I like that because um, you can do a lot of things with this strip of paper, and it just, I can think of like four or five right now. You can cut them out. Put them on your containers. Um, you can take the back of this. What I would do is if I framed anything or if I just hung it on the wall, I would tape it really good to the back of the painting. That way, if uh, I lost a diamond or something, I would have this to go by to replace that. Especially if you have one corner that you lose four or five diamonds in. That would be good for it. Um, a lot of people will put it on their table and use that as a reference. If the painting's too big, you know, you can uh, put this where you're working, where you have a, sorry about the shaking guys. I'm just kind of shaky today. Um, and I was touching the uh, <laughs> desk that um, my computer sits on. So that's just a, you know a couple things you can do with this and i'm sure there's a lot of other people out there that have more crafty a more crafty mind than what i do because i don't craft this is my craft <laughs> this is what i do i diamond paint and that's the close crafting that i will probably <laughs> ever come from <laughs> i uh it, it's just not something I grew up doing or anything, and I'm glad I found diamond painting. So, you know, it helps a lot with anxiety, stress, depression, and that's one reason why I love it. Okay, off to see the diamonds. I'm going to show you these pretty ABs first. 
that's my 310. That's my 310, and there's a big bags. Okay. Oh, it broke. Look at this color right here. Ain't she just gorgeous? It's bright, vibrant. I hope y'all can see the glitter in them. So pretty. A lot of times they have the white ones. The white ones a lot are the ABs. Um, but these are the 5200, so they're not the, uh, not the ABs. The ABs is 137, and one thing I learned about the ABs, they're going to be any, um, DMC code in the 100s. So, all the 100s are going to be AB diamonds. And look at that. Just so pretty. And I like their new packaging. It makes inventory so much easier. You can go just right down the line, do your inventory, you're done with it, package it back up or start kitting it up right away. It makes it easier for kitting up because it keeps your, uh, your order. All you have to do is keep these in order and bam, 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 and you're done. So it's one thing I like about this packaging. So, that's my diamonds, that's my painting, that's my toolkit, missing the glue, like I said, contact customer service if you run out into any problems with any company, and you should get what you want, if you don't, you should get your money back. That's what I've done with the companies on AliExpress that I've had issues with, I've I, out of all the paintings I've ordered, I've had three that I was unhappy with. It wasn't that they were missing something. There was something about the canvas that was wrong, like it being too dark. I couldn't read the symbols. And yes, you say use the light pad. I use the light pad. I use readers. And there's just some paintings that are so dark that you can't read the symbols. So I've got my money back on one of those. I have gotten money back on damaged canvases. And then I've had one company that sent me out replacement diamonds of some that uh, two colors that I run out of. So every time I've contacted customer service, I've had a good response from them. I know some people haven't, but for the most part, um, the customer service um, representatives do help in your needs. So, well, that's my video for today. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If not, eh. please subscribe to my channel. Hit that notification bell if you want notifications of future videos. If not, we'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.